I'll just mention the increased uh, fire risk uh, this morning uh, because of the winds added to the already dry conditions. Uh, there are a couple of things that firefighters want you to know with that increased risk. WGEM's Jack Pelesnik joins us with more on that part of the story. Jack, good morning. Natalie, good morning. There's one key difference between structure fires and brush fires, and that's mobility. Now, typically structure fires remain restricted to an individual building, but brush fires out in the open and spurred on by gusty winds can spread quickly. A local firefighter says to take precautions. If you do happen to be in an area where there is a brush fire, just make sure you dial 911. Um, stay away from the area, stay away from the windward side, which is the way that the direction the wind is blowing, and uh, just avoid it at all, at all costs. He advises those planning on burning outdoors to wait for less windy days before doing so. He told me brush fires can affect everyone, so be extra mindful over these next few days of dry and windy conditions. Natalie, back to you. All right, Jack, some good advice and firefighters say to combat the flames, they get ahead of the wind and fire, then put down water or a burn line. That way the fire cannot spread any further.